Hello all, and welcome back to Tangents on Cracked Spines. My name is Frankie, and I like to read public domain items aloud to you. Our major episodes currently are working on a collection of HP HP Lovecraft stories uh, with unedited commentary, but we've got a mini episode today. And it's Black History Month, and I could go ahead and do any number of famous people of color. But I wanted to talk about an American folk hero. There's a lot of them, but very few are people of color. In fact, John Henry is the only one I know of. Now, according to the Virginia Museum of History and Culture um, and a Scott Reynolds Nelson, he may not actually be a folk hero. Uh, He may have actually been a real 19-year-old from uh, from New Jersey who had been convicted uh, for theft in 1866 and sentenced to 10 years in penitentiary and put to work on the CNO Railroad, uh, working along steam-powered drills. And he was, his story wasn't just turned into uh, work songs, or into a folk uh, hero, but into a work song, uh, reminding workers to slow down or die as a tool of resistance and protest. Um, which, I mean, makes a lot of sense to me. Now, I'm not going to sing the work song to you because, honestly, it's been ages since I've actually heard what the folk song sounds like and not what, you know, the Johnny Cash version. Because, yes, Johnny Cash also has a version of the song. Um, And because it is, you know, a folk work song, there are several variations of it. Today's I am grabbing off of Songs for Teaching. And it says, John Henry was a little baby sitting on his papa's knee. He picked up a hammer and little piece of steel said, hammer's going to be the death of me. Lord, Lord, hammer's gonna be the death of me. The captain said to John Henry, gonna bring that steam drill round, gonna bring that steam drill out on the job, gonna whoop that steel on down. Lord, Lord, gonna whoop that steel on down. John Henry told his captain, a man ain't nothing but a man, but before I let your steam drill beat me down, I'd die with a hammer in my hand. Lord, Lord, I'd die with a hammer in my hand. John Henry said to his shaker, Shaker, why don't you sing? I'm throwing 30 pounds from my hips on down. Just listen to that cold steel ring. Lord, Lord, just listen to that cold steel ring. John Henry said to his shaker, Shaker, you'd better pray, because if I miss that little piece of steel, tomorrow be your burying day. Lord, Lord, tomorrow be your burying day. The shaker said to John Henry, I think this mountain's caving in. John Henry said to his shaker, Man, that ain't nothing but my hammer sucking wind. Lord, Lord, that ain't nothing but my hammer sh- sucking wind. Now the man that invented the steam drill thought he was mighty fine, but John Henry made 15 feet, the steam drill only made nine. Lord, Lord, that steam drill only made nine. John Henry hammered in the mountains, his hammer was striking fire, but he worked so hard he broke his poor heart. He laid down his hammer and he died. Lord, Lord, he laid down his hammer and died. John Henry had a little woman. Her name was Polly Ann. John Henry took sick and went to his bed. Polly Ann drove steel like a man. Lord, Lord, Polly Ann drove steel like a man. John Henry had a little baby. You could hold him in the palm of your hand. The last words I heard that poor boy say, my daddy was a steel driving man.
Lord, Lord, my daddy was a steel-driving man. They took John Henry to the graveyard and they buried him in the sand. And every locomotive comes a-roaring by, says, there lies a steel-driving man. Lord, Lord, there lies a steel-driving man. Well, every Monday morning when the bluebirds begin to sing, you can hear John Henry a mile or more. You can hear John Henry's hammer ring. Lord, Lord, you can hear John Henry's hammer ring. Now, one of the reasons I chose this, other than deciding to go with a folk uh, hero, was that uh, I grew up reading this as a book, listening to it as a um, I apologize. Listening to this as a song and seeing an animated cartoon about it. But I know a lot of people who've never heard of John Henry. And like growing up, that was a huge thing. This guy, this man, you know, beating out the steam drill and you know, trying to keep people on the road, on building the rails, and doing it better than the steam drill. Um, but also reading about it again, I'm like, yeah, no. I feel like that's still very valid, regardless of who you are. We, as technology increases we just get replaced and there's really no reason to you know literally work yourself to death um in this kind of society so yes there's nothing wrong with making a living and doing what you can but by no means should your life revolve around an employer who will have your job posted before your obituary is up. So, thank you for listening to me. I hope you liked hearing about, oh, listening to. Uh, one of the folk songs about John Henry. And you have a marvelous day, and I'll speak to you next week, wherein we will be listening to Fearless, another H.P. Lovecraft story. Bye-bye.